Well, been walking basically all day. It's a perfect day to look for sheds, but uh, it's been raining all day. I'm just soaked to the bone. I mean, I'm wearing some rain gear, but I'm soaking wet and haven't found a shed all day, but just walked up and I got an oldie right here. Actually, it's a match set oldie. I just found the other side. Jeez. This one's got like an inside tie on him. What's up guys, I just got out of work, off of work, and I ran out to the, one of these spots I have permission at, and I just walked up on a match set, it's my first match set I've ever found, I found quite a few sheds, but I've never matched one up, I just walked up on a match set, so I'll show you guys, that's the one I seen first, and then I looked up, boom, I'm pumped. Never found a match set before, but I'll pick them up here for you. There's the first one I seen, just right on this deer trail. Boom! Heck yeah! And, uh, seen that shed about. Yeah, definitely last nice year's decent one. Yeah, I believe that's the match. I found this one right here about, uh, I'd say, two or three weeks ago. And I had to have walked past this one at least three times. But, uh, video number two is up on the board. Today is February 28th, and starting this week, we're gonna hit it hard. I got a break from work a little bit, so hitting it hard. I'm walking over to a, a little farm right now to ask for permission. I've had permission in the years past, not sure if I'll get permission this year or not but it's worth a shot. Um, got a good feeling about it. Thinking I might pick a one or two up in there. So, gonna give it a shot, ask for permission. Uh, we're gonna put the miles on today, so let's go. Well guys, I got permission from that spot and uh, walked it for a little bit, probably an hour, an hour and a half. And I'm just leaving it now and I'm coming up on the first one of the day and it is a bike it was about I was probably about three yards from it when I found it I got a couple like this at home and by the way the shed was right on the other side of a fence they just put up this past fall laying right on a wood edge so it's hard to tell if it was a night bed or he lost it when he hopped the fence, but we'll take it. It's maybe five, ten minutes later after I found that spike. I just peeked over, found a nice little two point, three point side. Some nice thick cover here. That's 14. Well guys, I just glanced up. And it looks like I see a pretty decent one. It looks like the four point side. Uh, I don't know what buck it is. I'm gonna try to find the match. That's for sure. I'm. Have it, it hasn't even been five minutes since I picked that last shed up. Uh, oh, I see another shed. Uh, there's another shed right there. There's a shed right there. 
I just picked these two up like five seconds ago. I don't know if you can see it. There's one right in there. And then we got this four point side lane over here. If I don't fall when I'm getting to it, it could be a match. We'll take that. There's another set, there's another shed right there. There's a spike right there. Holy crap. That's 15, six, 16, 17. That's a two point. Holy crap. I don't know. No, it didn't look, it didn't look like the match to any of these other ones. But that's kind of crazy. Bang, bang. We're gonna have to scour this area if none of these are sets. And then one over here and it doesn't look like a set to any of these we got that one right there i don't think any of these are sets and i just found two of them while talking to you guys on the gopro that's not a set that could be a set right there that's not a set and a nice four. So I was at 12 to 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. 17, and that just happened in crazy amount of time. I'm gonna walk this hillside a bunch more. And really, there should be more sheds laying in here, if I'm correct, so. We're gonna get back to you, but man, that was a lot of sheds. Real close. But down in this creek, there's a shed laying down there. So, it might be a match to one of the ones I just found. Ah, cool little frozen in some ice. This little four side, something like that. I think I got the match. I think that's the match. I'd say they were about 60 yards apart. Well guys, if I had to guess, this is about the general area that the wide six point uh, was hanging out late season and is about the area I think he would drop his sheds if he dropped them on this piece of property. So, a bunch of old logged out timber and um, treetops falling here. So, a bunch of opportunities for deer to bed in this area here. And hopefully I'll pick some sheds up underneath some of these tops. Not what you want to see while shed hunting. It's break time. I wish I would have packed a lunch. I walk in this field edge and it looks like there's a little shed laying right off the food source. Ah, three point. I think I have his match and I found it right over there. I'm almost positive his match is in my backpack right now. And I probably found it 80 yards that way. That's seven for the day. I think 19 on the year, something like that. Just talked to Drake on the phone. Uh, I think we're working on a game plan out to uh, get in somewhere this evening. Uh, hopefully this sun uh, goes away. Is the hopes. Um, but yeah, hopefully pick some more up today. Right now, me and Joey came to one of my properties that I've been hunting for about three years now. And uh, just found a dead buck. And I believe it's this buck we called Lightning from through two years ago then, I when I first started hunting this block. Sad to see him go like that, but happy I could pick him up. Walking this bean field here, and uh, I just spotted one out in the middle of it. It's old, I mean, I don't know. 
how long it's been here. Must have been towed up many a times. But I will pick it up real quick. Look at that, just sticking out like a sore thumb. Right on this tree line, perfect spot to pick them up. Heck yeah. Not too shabby. <sighs> just came into one of the little farms I hunt. Uh, I hammered this farm early season a ton. And walking up in this little open green grassy area, as you see, uh, it's a big river bottom kinda. But there's a nice little three point side laying times down right in the little grassy plot. So I'll give you a little pick up. Freshy. That's number eight on the day. I think that might be uh, the best I've ever done in a day. I think I think it is. So setting records. Ooh. Well, I just was walking this creek down. I had to head out to the truck. And I looked over and I found another dead buck. This one's got both sides. I think that makes four dead deer on the day. A lot more deer than I thought. Dead. Well, guys, I ended up finding eight today. I think that's the most I've ever found in a day. Uh, Gavin found one today. Nice old one. And Drake's at two today. One old one, one freshy. Uh, all eight I found were fresh. And there's two match sets and four singles that I had. Uh, yeah. So here they are. That's Gavin's. That's a little match set. That's a little match set. Four singles, this is the best one I found today. But these ones are probably 80 yards apart. Those ones were probably 60 to 70 yards apart something like that so it's a good day you want to talk about your shed yeah. <laughs>